Christine. Thank you for joining me tonight for Restorative Yoga and Yoga Nidra. <sighs> so as you can see, um, I am just I just created a nice little nest here to um, have my restorative yoga. So I encourage you to have a nice space with your yoga mat or blanket on the floor. And I have some pillows. I have several pillows. You can't have enough pillows. So some big pillows, maybe some throw pillows, a blanket, make yourself nice and cozy. Perhaps you want to create an ambiance for yourself with some candles, which is nice. Perhaps you already have that set up. So this is very, this is very exciting to, to be here and do this program through the library. So I thank everyone for giving me this opportunity and you joining me for this tonight. So we're gonna start in a seated position and I'd like to invite you all to take that little pillow and place it underneath you here. So you can prop yourself up and to give you a little more space here in your spine so you can elongate your spine a little easier here, nice and tall. I like everyone to just close their eyes and just start to check in with yourself to see how you're feeling at this moment. Just noticing what's coming up for you. How your body's feeling at this moment. If there's any place you're holding, any tension, just noticing those places. Noticing your sit bones, sitting on the pillow, supported by the floor and the floor supported by the earth. I want you to feel your seat and your support in your body at this moment. Just begin to become aware of your breath, allowing the breath to lengthen and to deepen. Feel that breath as it expands, softens the belly, allowing that breath to fill the belly like a bellows or a balloon, feeling that belly with a deep breath. Maybe you can place your hands there and feel that breath. You want to feel your breath, your inhale and your belly expand outward as you inhale. And as you exhale, feel your belly drawing back towards the spine. Nice and slow. Yeah. Just begin to tune in to that sensation of breath, that wave-like motion in the belly. Take these first few moments just to arrive in our bodies, arriving in the breath. Feeling that breath originate deep down into the belly. Feel your breath hug your ribs into the side body. And then extend all the way to the top of the chest. So you want to feel your breath here, rising through the ribs and extending all the way to the chest. So maybe placing, allowing your left hand to rest onto the heart center and your right hand just above your belly button. Just start to feel this breath beneath the palms of your hands, noticing that sensation you feel in your body as you breathe. Your hands gently resting, feeling the breath move through the body. Noticing your shoulders, seeing if you can relax them a little more away from your ears. And notice if you're holding them up here, bring them down. So just taking these first few moments to simply breathe and receive our prana, that's our life force. Noticing your jaw, relaxing the face, soften those lips. Notice if you're clenching your teeth. You wanna have a nice soft face. Let the lips part slightly, but we're breathing in and out through the nose. Become aware of the temperature in the room where you are, perhaps any smells, any sounds that you hear. 
All your senses are alive. Noticing the thinking mind at this moment, noticing perhaps any thoughts that are coming in and allowing them to just dissolve like clouds would into blue sky, letting them just release, having no attachment to your thoughts, rather observing them as a compassionate witness to yourself. The mind is always thinking, so thoughts will come in and they'll, and they'll leave. And there's, letting yourself just become focused on that sensation of breath. So if your mind wanders, just draw your attention, attention to the breath and to sensation in the body. So this practice of restorative yoga is the yoga of non-doing. So we're really just allowing our bodies to relax and rest in poses for about five minutes each to allow your body to really soften and receive the poses passively. So that's why we need the support of pillows or bolsters or blankets, anything that you have to make yourself more comfortable. So I encourage you to have as many props as you'd like. So now that we've connected to our breath and we've arrived in our bodies, we've landed on our mats. I'd like you to create an intention for tonight's practice. What brought you to this program? What brought you to the mat tonight? Perhaps you're here to feel more at ease and at peace. We've had a lot of stuff happening in our lives, personal lives and in the world. And so we can tend to take all of that and store it into our bodies. So this is a great way to release anything that no longer serves us. So creating your intention, I would like you to repeat it three times as your mantra. This is a word or phrase that repeat over and over. Positive affirmation. So perhaps you're here because, as I said, to feel more at ease and peace, and you can simply state, I am at ease and I am at peace. So. Allow your intention to become, to state it in present tense as though it's already happening to you. You know, you may not feel more at ease and at peace at this moment, but you want to state it as though it's already happening to you. So you bring that positivity into the body. And just take this next few moments just to find those words of wisdom within the heart that speaks to you. you to open your eyes if they're already open and let's come into a couple of gentle yoga stretches before we pause into our restorative um, holding poses so let's interlace our fingers and press our palms up and we're going to just rock from side to side we're going to inhale and we're going to exhale and open the side body into the ribs. So when you inhale nice and tall, I'd like you to exhale with a cleansing breath. That's a big, wide, open jaw. So you inhale, and then you exhale. And if it feels better for you to have one arm go over at a time you can do it that way if that feels too constrictive to you to have both arms up one 
more time on each side. And let's bring your arms down in front of us, keeping your hands, fingers interlaced. Like you're holding a big giant beach ball in front of you. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna tuck your chin towards your chest and you're gonna round your spine like someone kind of just punched you on the stomach here and round. Tuck your chin to the chest to come off your sit bones slightly. Good, and then you're gonna inhale, you're gonna press the palms up to the sky. And then exhale, a cleansing breath. That's a sighing the breath out. Good, inhale. Look up to the hands. And then exhale, flip the palms towards your chest. Inhale up. Exhale back. Inhale. Exhale. Good. One more time. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Come up one more time. And this time let's bring our arms down. Let's roll our shoulders up and back for some shoulder rolls. And then place your hands onto your shoulders. And we're going to continue this movement. I'd like to bring your shoulder blades in towards one another. Open up, expanding over the chest and heart. Now slide your hands behind your back. Interlace the fingers and lift up, tuck your chin towards your chest. Expand the heart center, press the shoulder blades in. And release the arms down. And if sitting like this is uncomfortable for you at this time, you can always opt to take your legs out or sit in a comfortable seat that, that feels better for your body. Let's make some circles here and just see we dance. Follow the rhythm of your breath. Circling here. to close your eyes, perhaps. And let's reverse that rotation. Point and flex. Good. And let's come back 
into table pose. This is on your hands and knees. You want to have your knees parallel to your hips, shoulders to wrists, fan your fingers nice and wide. Let's just wiggle our hips side to side. Let's turn our hip to the right and look over your left shoulder. Inhale and exhale. And inviting you to, if this feels too much on your knees, you can always place a pillow under your knees, give you a little more cushion if you need to. The idea is to make yourself as comfortable as possible. Good. Back to center here, coming into cat cow. So allow your belly to dip down. Really allow the belly to soften towards the floor. Press your shoulder blades in. Look up. Take a breath here and exhale your chin to chest. I'm going to round and round here. Tailbone tucks under, chin to chest. The undulator spine back and forth through cat cow. Follow the rhythm of your breath. Moving through here. One more time in each posture. Good, and let's come down onto our forearms. You're gonna sink your tailbone down to your heels. So we're gonna make a circle. You're gonna circle the head at the same time. Let's reverse that rotation. And now we're ready to come into our first restorative pose. So some of you may know um, child's pose. We're gonna do this a little different. We're gonna use some pillows here. So I'm gonna take my big bed pillow and place it lengthwise here. I'm actually gonna take two pillows. And the idea here is to straddle your pillows. You may need, I don't know, what kind of surface you have um, at home. Maybe you're on a rug and it's, it's more forgiving for your knees, but if you need a little extra cushion, I would recommend maybe taking your blankets and placing that lengthwise across to have a little more cushion for your knees. We're gonna bring our chest and our belly over our pillows like this. So we're nice and cozy. Now you can have your legs out wide. That feels good. Maybe you feel better with your knees in closer. So just take this moment to set up your pillows so that you feel completely comfortable. Maybe you need even another layer. Maybe you only need one. It'll be different for everybody. Perhaps this doesn't feel good on your knees. Perhaps, perhaps you, 
you lay like this on your side a little bit. And relax like this. So you want to find a way that you can just pause and allow your muscles to release, allow the mind to quiet, and just be present. Finding a way that feels good for your neck. My head's turned towards the left. Maybe it feels better to turn your head towards the right. Or perhaps, or perhaps you like to just try both sides, maybe a couple minutes on either side. You decide what feels good. to join you here with a little restorative child's pose. Notice the sensation you feel in your body. Where do you feel the releasing? Where can you soften maybe a little more? How can you adjust to make it a little more comfortable? Noticing how your cheek feels on the pillow, softness. Noticing the pause between each breath. Noticing the length of your breath. Noticing what's coming up at this moment and letting it drift away. Perhaps you'd like to turn your head in the other direction and see if that feels good.
we'll pause here for three more deep breaths. And then we'll slowly begin to come out of our pose. Place one pillow towards the front of your mat. And another pillow under your knees. Line our backs. Keeping yourself in your lying down position here. Let's bring our arms overhead. We're going to just give a body stretch. You're going to just point your toes, reach out through the fingertips. And let's hug our knees into the chest. We're gonna make some circles. Cap with the palms of your hands. Your knees are about hip width apart. Draw your knees in towards the chest and circles. So you have a nice little massage on that lower back into the sacrum. And let's reverse this rotation. of your feet back to your mat go back to your pillow I like you to take your two smaller pillows if you have them. if you have big pillows that's fine but you need two pillows the others on either side of your hips and you're gonna bring your feet together like this like like a butterfly and you're gonna open your legs up here so that your have that support of the pillows. We're gonna open the hips and the inner thighs. So our feet together like this, legs open, pillows on either side for support. So, Getting yourself cozy here. Perhaps you like your blanket on you. Perhaps you're already nice and cozy. Just allow your eyes to soften. Allowing the support of the pillows or your thighs. Feel a gentle opening in the hips and thighs. The nice support of the pillow. I have my feet on top of my other pillow, which feels really nice on my feet. 
We're gonna pause here and this is restorative butterfly pose. Focusing on that breath, feel the belly expanding, softening, breath rising, hugging ribs and extending to the chest, the jar is soft, the mind is quieting. Draw your attention to sensation in the body. Perhaps the music. Breath. Maybe it'd feel nice to bring both hands either side of your belly to feel that breath, to connect a little deeper to that sensation. As you take your next inhale, breathing in the word love, and exhale the word kindness. Love and kindness. Inhale love. Exhale kindness. Love and kindness. On your next inhalation, inhale the word peace. Exhale the word joy, peace and joy. Now inhale the word light, light, and exhale the word gratitude, inhale light, exhale gratitude, light and gratitude.
And on our next inhale, let's bring the arms overhead and bring the legs down. Stretch them out, big body stretch, taking your legs out of butterfly. Point the toes, reach to the fingertips. Good, arms come down by your side. We're gonna set up for our next restorative pose. We're gonna come into a supported twist here. So take a pillow beside you. On your, I'm on my right side, the pillow. I come onto my side just a little bit and bring my left knee on top of the pillow. I'm gonna bring my arms out in a T position. Perhaps you have another pillow beside you. You can rest your arm on that. Give you a little more rest for your shoulder. And then you're gonna turn your head slightly to the left, just a little bit. If it feels better for you to keep your head turned toward the right and if it strains your neck, then keep it there. Otherwise, just a little turn toward your left shoulder. You have your props, so you have your pillow, you can have it maybe tucked under that hip a little bit here to just give you a little more support. My elbow is rested on my other little pillow. You can't see that behind there, but it's there. So you have your props. Find a way that you can really just rest into your twist. is lengthening and deepening and our pausing here. The only thing that exists now is your body and breath. Letting go of the thinking mind. Allowing your intuition to guide you. Adjusting as needed. Make yourself as comfortable as possible. deep breaths here. And when you feel ready, we'll roll back onto our backs. Hug your knees back into your chest. Have a nice hug in, box the head. This time, let's rock from side to side. And we'll set up for our twist on the other side. So I'm gonna just turn myself around so you can see me better. Setting up 
lifting up your pillows. Arms out, extra pillow, relax that arm. Again, turning your head towards your right shoulder if that feels comfortable. If not, just keep your head neutral. Holding these poses a little longer and focusing on our breath we help to relax our nervous system, the parasympathetic, which is our rest and digest. All healing takes place. Lowering our blood pressure. Noticing how this feels in your body, perhaps where you can adjust and relax a little more. Maybe your head needs to come back or neutral. Noticing how the soft pillow feels underneath your leg, how the pillow feels under your head. More deep breaths here and a twist. And then slowly come out of your twist. Going back onto your back, 
Another big body stretch, the arms overhead. Reaching back. Hmm. Noticing how you feel. Then come on to your side and so you can roll up into your seat. We're gonna prepare now for our last resting pose here with Shavasana for our guided meditation called Yoga Nidra, which means yoga sleep. It's a five, I'm sorry, it's an eight stage guided meditation that takes you to your five states of being, which is called your koshas. So all you need to do is make yourself your, make your nice nest, have your pillow for your head, have your pillow for underneath your knees, and perhaps a blanket to place over you. This might be a good time if you needed to um, go to the bathroom. <laughs> um, so you don't want to be there going, oh no, I have to go and miss it. So I'm going to just give you um, a minute or two to go and do that if you need to, to make yourself comfortable as much as you can. I'm gonna just change the music and put another log on the fire. And then we'll do yoga nidra. We'll do that in about two more minutes, okay? So I'm gonna give you some time. If you need a sip of water, if you needed to go to the bathroom, you can do that now, okay? need to listen. So allowing yourself now to settle in your space. Your head is rested on top of your pillow, your knees. top of your other pillow, perhaps a blanket. Getting nice and cozy. Allow your arms to come out by your side, palms are face up if that feels comfortable. Coming into stillness, letting go of any movement. Aware of your body, relaxing, releasing, receiving.
aware of your muscles. Feel your muscles begin to soften deep down into your bones. Aware of your bones resting here onto Mother Earth, feeling the support of the floor and then beneath the floor, the ground. And feel your support in your bones and your muscles. Feeling rooted and grounded at home in your body. Feel the support the back of your head releasing down into the pillow. Noticing your jaw as the face is soft. All your senses are awakened. Begin to imagine yourself in a place it's called your inner sanctuary. Your inner sanctuary is a place of peace, of joy, comfort, relaxation. This place could be somewhere you visited before, maybe on vacation, Perhaps on a tropical island, perhaps a hike in the woods, perhaps sitting on the beach, perhaps sitting by a fire, perhaps at home in a comfortable chair with a beloved pet. This could be an imaginary place, perhaps somewhere you've never been before. It can be any place where in your mind's eye you can see that gives you a sense of pleasure and peace. So take these next few moments to see this landscape. Notice all the colors. Notice all the shapes. Notice any special objects you may see here. Anything is possible in your inner sanctuary. It's a special place just for you. All your senses are alive. Notice how it sounds in your inner sanctuary. Is there any special sound you hear? Is there anything here that you can smell? How does it feel to be present in your inner sanctuary? Is there anything possibly to touch or taste? Anything is possible in your inner sanctuary.
see yourself here in your inner sanctuary. Noticing what you're wearing, what's happening in your inner sanctuary around you. next deep breath in. Begin to imagine your heart center. See your heart. Imagining your heart. Noticing the shape of your heart. With each and every breath, Feel your heart softening and expanding open with the breath. Imagine in your heart floating in a sea of emerald green color. Feel your heart being bathed, gentle waves undulating in the heart center, massaging the heart, softening. Expanding the heart. Breathe into the heart center. Your heart is open and receptive. And you ask your heart, what is my heart's longing? What does my heart long for? A heart's longing is a statement of truth, a positive resolve. A positive affirmation, a mantra, like we did in the beginning of class. Your heart's longing is a statement of truth. So take this moment to find your heart's longing. What does your heart have to say? And when you find that, state it three times as the truth, as though it's already happening to you. Maybe there are no words. Maybe you see it in a symbol picture. Take this time to discover the heart's longing. It's your truth. It's perfect in every way. Positive affirmation. Positive result. On your next inhalation, become aware of the crown of your head. 
as we take a journey through our body, the body sensing, without needing to move in any way, just notice the crown of your head. Feel the crown of your head. Aware of the back of your neck, the back of your neck. Feel the back of your neck. Aware of your shoulders, your shoulders. Feel your shoulders. Aware of your shoulder blades, right shoulder blade and left shoulder blade. Feel your shoulder blades. Aware of your upper back, your upper back. Feel your upper back. Notice your mid back, your mid back. Feel your mid back. Aware of your lower back, your lower back. Feel your lower back. Notice your spine, your whole spine. Feel your spine. Aware of your back, your whole back. Your whole back. Feel your whole back. Noticing your tailbone. Feel your tailbone, your tailbone. Notice your buttocks, right side and left side. Feel both sides. Notice the backs of your thighs, right side and left side. Feel the backs of your thighs. Aware of the backs of your knees, backs of your knees. Feel the backs of your knees. Aware of your lower legs, the backs of your lower legs, your calves, right side, left side. Feel your calves. Aware of the heels of your feet. Feel the heels of your feet. Right heel, left heel. Feel the heels of your feet. Aware of the soles of your feet. The soles of your feet. Feel the soles of your feet. Aware of your toes on your right foot. Notice your right big toe. Second toe. Third toe. Fourth toe. And fifth toe. Feel all your toes on your right side. Notice your left big toe. Second toe. Third toe. Fourth toe. And fifth toe. Feel all your toes on your left foot. And feel all 10 toes. 
all ten toes. Aware the tops of your feet, right foot and left foot. Feel the tops of both feet. Aware of your ankles, right ankle and left ankle. Feel your ankles. Notice the tops of your lower legs, your shins, right side and left side. Feel your shins. Notice your knees, right side and left side. Feel your knees. Aware of the tops of your thighs, right side and left side. Feel your thighs. Notice your pelvis. Your pelvis. Feel your pelvis. Notice your right hip and left hip. Feel your hips. Notice your belly button. Your belly button. Feel your belly button. Aware of your belly, your solar plexus. Feel your belly, your belly. Aware of your ribs, right side and left side. Feel your ribs. Feel your ribs. And say to yourself, I'm awake and aware. I'm awake and aware. Becoming aware now of your chest, your chest. Feel your chest. Noticing your heart center, heart center. Feel your heart center. Noticing your collarbone, your collarbones. Feel your collarbones. Aware of your right shoulder, your right shoulder. Feel your right shoulder. Aware of your right arm. Notice top of the right arm, elbow, forearm. Aware of your right wrist, top of the right hand, palm of the hand. Aware of your right hand's thumb. First finger, second finger, third finger, and fourth finger. So all five fingers. Aware of your whole right shoulder, arm, hand, and fingers. Feel your whole right arm, hand, and fingers. Notice your left shoulder, shoulder, feel your left shoulder. Notice the left arm, top of the left arm, elbow, forearm, left hand's wrist, top of the hand, palm, Left hand's thumb, first finger, second finger, third finger, fourth finger. Feel all your fingers. Aware of your whole left shoulder, arm, hand, and fingers. Feel your whole left arm, hand, and fingers. Aware now of your throat center. Feel your throat, your throat. Feel your throat. Aware of your chin, your chin. Feel your chin. Notice your jaw, right side and left side. Feel your jaw. 
Noticing your lips, upper lip and lower lip. Notice your lips. Aware of your mouth, inside the mouth. Notice your teeth. Notice your tongue, inside the right cheek, inside the left cheek. Notice sensation in the mouth, aware of taste. Feel your mouth. Aware of your nose, right nostril, left nostril. Aware of breath, aware of smell. Feel your nose. Noticing your eyes, right eye and left eye. Feel your eyes. Noticing sight, feel your eyes. Aware of your eyebrows, right eyebrow and left eyebrow. Feel your eyebrows. Noticing your ears, right ear, left ear, inside the ear canals, aware of the sense of hearing. Feel your ears. Aware of the forehead, forehead, feel your forehead. Feel your forehead. Noticing the crown of the head. The crown of the head. Feel the crown of the head. Aware of your whole back body. Whole back body. Feel your whole back body. Noticing the front of your body. The front of your body. Feel the front of your body. and sense your whole body, your whole body, feel your whole body. Noticing now your breath, your breath. Feel your breath in your body. Notice inhalation, feel your exhalation. Notice inhalation, feel your exhalation. Notice the pause between the breath. Notice the pause between the breath. And now aware of your body feeling warm. Your body feels warm as though you were lying in the sun, feeling your skin being kissed by the sun. Feel your body warm. Your body is warm. And now notice your body cool. Cool. Feel your body cool. Like a cool sea breeze. Cool sea breeze. Nice, refreshing coolness. Feel cool in your body. And notice your body warm. Warm as though you were sitting by a cozy fire warm. Feel your body warm. Your body is warm. And feel that refreshing breeze of coolness. Your body is cool. Feel your body cool.
and feel your body warm and feel your body cool. Feel your body warm and feel your body cool. Feel your body warm and cool at the same time. Warm and cool. And say to yourself, I'm awake and aware. I'm awake and aware. To take you on your journey, begin to either notice yourself from above or behind or wherever you like to see yourself. Noticing yourself now on a warm spring day. You are on a trail. And beside the trail is a line with beautiful trees. Noticing evergreens and birch trees. You can hear the birds. You can smell the coolness, freshness in the air. You can feel the warm sun kissing your face. All your senses are alive. Coolness in the air, warmness, on the skin, birds singing. And then you see a red cardinal flying by, leading you further down the path. You see a little red cardinal, crimson red, beautiful, bird leading you down this path noticing the beauty the landscape as you follow the cardinal he leads you to a pond and around the pond are tall grasses and cattails. And you see dragonflies. And you see the kaleidoscope of rainbow colors, iridescent in the wings, reflected from the sun. You see yourself stepping to the edge of the pond and notice a white lotus flower floating in the middle of the pond. One lotus flower. You see how it gently dances on top of the water in the breeze dancing on top of the water in the breeze. The lotus flower floats over to where you are standing. And the lotus flower becomes big enough for you to step inside. You see yourself Step slowly inside the lotus flower. The lotus flower is soft and open like satin. As though you were floating in a cloud 
a lotus flower cradles you in her petals, supporting you. You feel completely at ease and at peace in the flower. You notice a sweet fragrance. You notice a sweet fragrance. You breathe it in. And you hear a gentle humming sound, a flower, like an ohm sound, hum. And you feel your body vibrating this beautiful sound through every sound. And you feel yourself floating in this flower and she gently rocks you back and forth like you were in a cradle. And you recall your heart's longing, your heart's longing, your statement of truth you stated in the beginning of class. You remember this heart's longing and your heart is open like this lotus flower to receive this wisdom of yourself. Feel your heart opening. And you see a small lotus flower inside the heart opening, like the one that you're sitting in. Recalling your heart's longing, stating it three more times as the truth, for indeed it is. And with your next breath, the lotus flower gently floats back to the shore to bring you back. You see yourself gently stepping out of the lotus flower onto land. Feel your feet rooted and grounded onto the earth. And your friend, the Cardinal, is there to lead you. He's leading you back up the path, noticing the trees. And so you see yourself standing at the foot of the path where you started. And when you take your next inhalation, you will see yourself lying on your mat, on your blanket, wherever you are in your nest at home, at ease and at peace, just like you were in the flower. Allow your breath to lengthen and to deepen. See yourself as you were looking down at yourself from above. And you see yourself smiling back at yourself. A soft, serene face, soft smile. And start to wiggle your fingers and toes, deepening your breath some more, bringing yourself back from your journey. Bring your arms overhead for a big body stretch, reaching out through the fingertips and clenching your toes. Hug your knees into your chest and rock side to side and come into fetal position on your right side. your left palm into the floor, coming back into your seat. Take your time here. If you, if you need to like keep lying down, that's fine too. 
if you need to be on your side or on your back, and you want to just lay there because it's cozy and you're comfortable, I invite you to do that. Oh. So some of you may have fallen asleep, which is perfectly normal to do during this practice. But your subconscious gets everything that I said. So some of you may have dozed in and out of sleep. And that happens. So thank you so much for coming tonight's practice. This is so nice to have you here with me at home, having self-care and we need this more than ever. We need it, we need it anyway, but even now more, as you all know. <laughs> So let's end our practice with bringing our hands together in prayer. I invite you to bring your hands in prayer in front of the heart to acknowledge your divine wisdom. And we'll do a mudra and a mantra to end our practice. And we're going to come into a mudra called Lotus Flower. It's called Padma, which is Lotus Flower. So we did a journey in the lotus flower, so I don't know if some of you may have missed that part because you may have dozed off or be floated around in the lotus flower. And hands together like in prayer, and then take your pinkies and thumbs together and open the rest of the fingers up like this, like you're a flower. We opened our heart like a lotus flower. And just recalling that intention, bringing it into the heart. Scaling it in, back to prayer, to acknowledge your divine wisdom, honor your yoga, body, mind, and spirit. And may you find peace and loving kindness, happiness, laughter, joy, hope, gratitude, and light within your own heart. And may we all find this in our whole wide world. Om Shanti, peace to you, and namaste. Thank you so much. Have a great evening.